Hello and thank you so much for clicking this video. Today I'd like to take all of that mystery work out of figuring out how to schedule your posts to be posted on Instagram. So when you're trying to get your page automated and you're thinking about different ways that you can build content, the last thing you wanna be doing is figuring out at what time of day you're going to make what post, what is going up when, and trying to get yourself a schedule that is not automated. I wanna introduce you to this app called Later. I'm gonna step you through some of the basic introductory ideas about this app and get you going with scheduling all of your social media posts at once. If it's your first time joining us, welcome. Please hit that subscribe button so that you never miss a new video from us. Give me a thumbs up if this was at all helpful to you and please leave me a comment below and let me know what you'd like to see more of on YouTube. So let's jump right in together. This is the website, it is later.com. So if you go to this website, you're going to be prompted to sign up for an account. I'd like to let you know that you can sign up for a free account. You do not have to spend money on this if you don't want to. If you find that you are being limited by some of the options on this website, definitely feel free to look at their pricing tier. It goes up depending on what your needs are, but there is a free platform to use for you and your account. So you can have a look at that. And that's all I'm gonna be using today is just the free account. So one of the first things you want to do is make sure you have enough content to schedule ahead for yourself. There's nothing worse than trying to come up with different content every single day. It becomes really tiring. So you wanna batch this work together. You wanna to go and find all of the content you're going to be posting for the next week or two or three or however far ahead you'd like to be getting. Once you've collected all of this information, once you've got the videos, the pictures, all the captions, all the kind of tags that you're wanting to be using, you can go across to the later website and you'll see a platform that looks like this. On the right here, I have picture of my Instagram page. We're signed in as carrot, celery, peach, pear. You can see our newsfeed is right here. On the left, I have loaded up all of these items to be dropped into our schedule over the next little while. So if you wanna add any sort of content here, if you come up with a new picture or something, all you have to do is drag and drop it right onto this media calendar here, and we're going to be bringing it across to our phone. So let me show you what that looks like. But the first thing you're going to wanna do is come in here and set up a schedule for yourself. If you come here to the right hand side, you'll see the visual planner scheduling. It's really easy to use and it gets you thinking about what kind of schedule you want for your social media posts. Maybe you are the kind of account that gets posting every single day, that posts content every single day. Maybe you only post on three different days a week. Maybe you post three times a day a couple days a week. So whatever it is that you post, you can set that schedule up in here. It's going to look a little bit like this we're gonna be prompted to create some time slots. And I'm going to say that I post every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. So I can go ahead and get rid of Sunday schedule, Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays. But again, definitely add these back in if you post on this kind of content every day. So I'm gonna select Monday. I'm going to be posting at 5 p.m. local time on Monday. Wednesday, I'm going to be posting at 3 and Friday I'm going to be posting at 1 p.m. Now again, you can go into the analytics about this. This website definitely offers you great analytics. So see what's working and do more of that. So if you find you get more content engagement on a Monday morning, certainly come in here and plan to post on a Monday morning. This is me just setting up an example so that you can see how the scheduling works. I'm going to press next and it's going to give you a brief overview about what I'm just about to show you as well, which is how easy it is to drag the media you'd like to be posting on those time slots onto your phone and plan what it looks like. So I'm going to press next and I can show you that in just a moment. Hit finish and we can get started. It says success. Three time slots have been set up. Let's say I'd like to post this bear next. So I'm going to just drag this across and pop it into place. I can hit save changes and it's going to load that in to the very next time slot. The next time slot for me is 3 p.m. on the 23rd of September, which is tomorrow for me a Wednesday because we said that we were posting on a Wednesday. 
Let's say I'd like this cool road picture coming on next. It's going to go there. And let's say I add the beach as well following that post. I can go ahead and hit uh, save changes. Uh, to be quick selected, I've just thrown them both in. And you can see that it's gone ahead and followed the technique that we want. Three o'clock, one o'clock, and five o'clock on the dates that correspond with that time of the week. You can also view this in week mode, so you can see these going in at the certain time slots. And if you're not happy with it, you can click and drag it around to the proper time slot. You can look at this overview through the month. If you post on certain days and you wanna see those overview on the month, you can go ahead and do that. I will say that if you are using the free plan on later, you are limited to 30 posts per month, which is one a day on average. So that usually is plenty for most people using the free account. If you're finding that you're being limited by that, go ahead and look at the upgrades plans. They are very reasonably priced. And if this is something that you are doing for your business or your company, it's definitely worth having a look and seeing if this is a good investment for you. Okay, so once I am happy with the places that I have filled in my media, getting them all ready in the time slot, the next thing we're going to be doing is adding the captions and the content that goes with these pictures. All right, so here is our, uh, here is our schedule right here. I've only thrown a couple of things in. Feel free to throw as many in as you would like, but I'm just showing you how to use this website. So if you click on that picture, it's going to open up its personal post. And here is where we fill out the information we would like to post alongside this photo. If you upgrade your plan, you can also be the first comment on your picture. If you want to throw your hashtags in there and hide those from making your caption too messy, you can go ahead and do that in an upgraded plan. If you have a business account on your Instagram, you will be able to have this auto post for you. So currently it's going to say, send me a notification right when this is about to be posted and I will hit yes post, it will post for me. But if you want to upgrade that so that you don't have to hit yes and approve every single one, definitely set up a business account for yourself and you can go ahead and it will post automatically, which is fantastic. So once I'm happy with my caption, I've added the tags I would like to add to this, I can hit save and that has scheduled a post. It says, congratulations, you have scheduled a post. You will get a push notification when it's time to publish. That will be on your phone. So that's the next thing I want to show you really quickly is that you have the app on your phone. It looks a little something like this and you can do all of this from inside the app on your phone as well. But I love this website because it definitely lets you do it from a desktop website, which I find very easy to organize, especially because that's where a lot of my photos live. So there you have it. That is how you schedule posts on Instagram. If you found this helpful, please give me a thumbs up and let me know what you think.